So, census. Why are we here? Why are we discussing it? And it's, it's really important uh, that everyone, everyone in this county gets counted. And people are like, well, what's the priority? There's a lot of priorities. Uh, $900 billion are at stake, first and foremost. And if you look at how the census impact our community with the amount of people counted, it affects the hospitals, SNAP, different grants that come into the county. So it has a huge impact and this will go on for the next decade. So it is so important. And then also you look at our House of Representatives. Uh, we're down to 27 members, where I think we're at an all-time high at one point in time at 44. And as we lose people out of this, this state, we lose another representative. And it could change who represents us up here. It could change our, our great Congressman Paul Tonko. It could change a variety of things, depending on where the number comes from. So that's the other main reason too but most importantly uh the state of new york's giving out um with the federal government 200 225 thousand dollars and with our commitment because we're putting money behind it too it's going to be a total of three hundred thousand dollars that we're going to do nonprofit groups uh different community stakeholders to help us make everyone count and it's so important so uh We'll be seeking proposals from groups that will be able to effectively reach out to historically undercounted groups like immigration, minority communities, those without internet access. Unfortunately, even though we are in the city of Albany, there's people without internet access. Um, so we're here today with the executive director from RISE to, uh, to really help us get the message out there. But before I turn it over to you, um, one of the things that uh, I want to say to people, go to our RFP. We have an RFP out, and I want you to contact our Department of Purchasing v. email at karen.storm at albanycounty.gov or by calling 518-447-7140. And uh, by doing that, you can get, you know, especially for your group, mm -hmm. and everyone out there watching this or listening, uh, we want you to be able to reach out to us uh, help us spend the money, but help us count people in your community because we're, we are reaching out to everyone um, Because you're the ones that are on the forefront in our communities. You're the ones that are in the trenches in our communities You're the ones that see people day in day out and uh, look it. It's uh, even people that are here I, I actually will steal this line from our Attorney General Chish James. She gave a speech and when she was speaking people are she said even Everyone, illegal aliens should be counted. And people in the room started booing. And she said, whoa, whoa. And she fought back and she gave a powerful speech. And I don't want to paraphrase everything she said, but she goes, everyone counts. Because everyone that's here, we get money for. Everyone that gets recognized, we get money for. So it is important. It's not a count to turn over to government and, and say, hey, look, this person's here illegal. It's a count so we get the benefits we're entitled to. And uh, so it's so, so important. Um, especially for here in Albany County. Good morning. Thank you to Mr. Dan McCoy, our ex uh, county executive, community representatives, and members of the press for joining us here today at the Refugee and Immigrant Support Services of Emace. We appreciate the importance of counting all people in the upcoming census for accurate federal representation and budget support for our local programs. We will be part of the outreach to people newly arrived in the U.S. with English as a second language to help them participate in the process. We are very grateful that our county uh, welcomes newcomers who bring their love of freedom and strong work ethics to our communities. And um, I would also like to, to tell that, you know, uh, um, Mr. Dan McCoy mentioned about the grant and uh, definitely we are going to apply for that grant and for the organization like us who are trying to do a lot with little this money is going to help a lot and I also think that uh, without the support of organizations like like us who are reaching out to the people who are hard to reach out language barrier you know just the hesitation uh, to to not understanding the culture over here. So uh, counting is so important and uh, uh, as we have been hearing a lot, everyone counts. So please 
help that every everybody gets count and we appreciate the support thank you very much thank you you know you brought up some excellent points that um, the language barrier but also people that don't realize that are here legal um, they come from a country sometimes where their governments aren't so friendly and they're afraid of government and uh, we need organizations like rise to really break down that barrier to help them understand uh, that they can be counted in a fair way and not have anything happen to them so which is so important and thank you for bringing that up but I don't know if you have any questions we're all set thank you